Hello, and thank you for joining us, everybody. This is Glenda with Freylands and Friends. And what you're looking at is tonight's project. I've started it, but there's a lot to go. So <laughs> I'm just welcoming you to the channel, and we'll be with you in a moment to show you what this is all about. Okay, here we go again. I had Joe drill a couple of holes and I strung a big piece of wire up through and did some twisting, cut a couple of pieces and twisted in and that's kind of how it is right now. I'm trying to mix a little yellow in with this so it's not, I want it to look like tree bark but I don't want it to just be, you know, all one specific color all the way through. I've let it have bumps and twists here a little bit like a tree would. And no, we will not finish this tonight. <laughs> Usually it's Joe that's able to get those shots because I'm too noisy. Joe's one of those people that can sneak up on you and you never know he's there. Me, I've always had a heavy foot. And I don't mean on the accelerator. I mean when I'm walking. Even on a even when I was thin, people would say, you walk too loud. And it was like, what do you want? I'm just walking. We watched Homeland, and you could always tell when Carrie, the one, the kind of the main character of the whole thing, you could always tell when she was coming. Or when she was going. Because she had, that was one of the distinctions that was Carrie. She, <laughs> her feet were like clop, clop, clop. You know, that businesswoman who's got a destination and she's focused on it. And she is going. <laughs> oh, there's a nice gnarly looking What do we call that now? <laughs> kind of a junction in the tree. It's, of course, not going to look like an absolute real tree, but at least it will hold our birds. And I want it to look somewhat natural. Looky there. Look at that. I left some nice little... And those aren't even actually intentional, a lot of them. They're just... But it's just I'm not smoothing them out. <clears throat> I'm simply not smoothing them out. I hesitate, but I will raise you a little. My desk is an absolute, absolute, as always, torrential mess. I think I'm going to start making just some little snakes, but I want the color to start slightly changing here. And I'll probably put more little bits of color, you know, like different colors of brown and stuff.
sorry to interrupt your music, but I'm going to give you an explanation. I've mixed some gray with some brown. I want some different tones in here. Kind of a barky look, you know, not like a dog bark, 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 but just bark. So you can see I'm putting some texture in it with some crumpled up foil. And that's just going to kind of go wherever I decide to put it. <laughs> Well, it's time for our bluebird to have a home. And so we are wiring him into the tree. <laughs> right now he has some wire legs. Once he's baked on here. I'll and the plan was to put some, some better looking bird different legs, legs on him. Right now, I just want and him attached. He's just kind of giving me a little bit of, well, when you consider I'm putting him into soft clay anyway. <laughs> and I'm trying not to mess his wings or anything up. Wings. But I think he turns out pretty good. Yes, we still have our wings. Our eyes, our beak, our tail. All's looking pretty good. What do you think so far? Okay, confession, that was a couple of days ago, and now here is our bird in her tree. <laughs> she looks a little happy there. And there's some, I put some green grass, I did some green grass, I tried some flowers, I think they look alright, but my buggies. Put some little bugs down there, and you can't even see them in this lighting, but a little worm, and there's some, there's a worm somewhere on the tree. I keep missing it because I'm looking. There he is. There's a worm on the tree. So, Mr. Bluebird's at his tree, and he's happy as can be. Thank you, everybody. I just want you to enjoy our bird in the bath again. And we're all going to say good night. Have a wonderful day or evening or whatever. If you love you, please subscribe. Click the notification bell and give us a thumbs up. And we'd love to see you again on Monday. Good night.